Hi, welcome to this 2015 Nissan Rogue SL. She's all wheel drive in this gun metallic here. Got the block heater cord right down here. You notice the nice Nissan V Motion front grill. As I come in close here on the front bumper and hood, we're certainly not seeing very much for rock chips or any type of paint damage there. I do see here we've got some nice 3M protection on the front there. Tires are in great shape. And we got the signal lights here on the outside of the mirror. The camera down here for 360 around view on this 2015. We'll look up here where we see sunroof, moonroof. And she's already coming with the crossbars on the roof rack. Down here we see our four wheel disc brakes. Nice rims on her. And we come around to the back where we have a power end gate and a one inch hitch receiver on the back has been added to it. When we look inside here, we've got divide and hide cargo with different layers of putting things and hiding stuff. We've got our seats that go down in a 60-40 split. And a power outlet right down here. As well as we got some tie down hooks here for cargo. Close her down. We got a backup camera right here up by where the plate would go. See the nice lines here down the 2015 Rogue SL all-wheel drive. And we'll have a look see in the back seat where we've got some door storage, power windows, and all-weather floor mats, back seat pockets, and our own vents back here. A little lever right up here. Drops the seat down for extra storage to the back. Little lever here to pull to drop this center down for the cup holders for the back seat here. And you see that just comes down there where we got our cup holders and then easy access to the back as well through there. Cool feature here in this Rogue. A little bar under here for the second row back seat where you can adjust that as well. Nice clean, no rips in the seat. Seeing no damages, no dents, no scratches. And we'll hop in the driver's seat, where we're going to see power driver's seat, power mirrors, locks and windows, again the all-weather floor mats. Down here is where we have eco mode, sport mode, or 360 safety shield, your all-wheel drive lock, um, traction control, hill descent assist. Up in lots of cab room for me at 64, which is awesome to see. Got a cruise control here, Bluetooth voice command. Got some stereo volume controls here. This little button toggles through what we see up in here, where we'll find that we've got blind spot warning, lane departure warning, forward collision warning. Got an auto dimming rear view mirror, and here's our camera where we can see our front view. Our 360 around view, when we push that camera button again, it drops down and shows you the curb view. And then off, we have the exact same thing for our backup camera with the predictive path route that we're going. Again, the 360 around view and the curb view for that. We got our dual climate controls, 
down here USB auxiliary input and a power outlet as we come here we'll move down cup holders heated seats and into the center console we have two layers just the first tray and then deeper down in where there's another power outlet down in there again I'm seeing no rips tears in the seats door storage and a very deep glove box with the owner's manual still in there which is always nice to see and of course we go up here where we see sunroof moonroof from the inside which is always nice